President is visited. The chamber is now back in session. L'audience est reprise. I would like now to give the floor to the civil party lawyers of Group 3. Je donne la parole au groupe 3 If you have maintenant. questions to be posed to the accused, the floor is yours. Thank you, Mr. Accused, for answering my question. I only have two questions to for you. Deux questions à poser à and I would then ask for my president's permission for my colleague to continue to take the floor. Après quoi, j'aimerais, si vous le voulez bien, Monsieur le Président, que mon confrère poursuive. You claimed the people who were arrested and sent to the re-education office S24 at Prezor was that before they were sent to Prezor, they would be sent to the location max Ah. Passé d'abord par le point so marqué R sur le point. They were placed at the location marked A. How long were they kept there and what, were, what did they do to, the, de to those people before they were sent to Pressor? Pres the accused, uh, Miss Lawyer, the R location was on the maps that I drew for the co-investigating judges at Street 360. And that location was purchased by Mr. Mom Somnang Do for his Beehive radio station. At that time, it was like a temporary location to receive those people. So after the people at that location received, then they were sent directly to Preso. Thank you for your information, says the lawyer. My second and last question. Merci. Voici ma deuxième et dernière question. In your mind, when you were in charge of S21, including Preso, à votre avis, lorsque vous étiez did you believe that those people who were regarded as the elements que vous were dangerous and could cause any risk or danger to the party? Un risque ou un danger pour le parti? The accused Miss Lawyer? Réponse. To believe it completely? No. Je ne le croyais pas complètement. In simple layman term, is that I, of course, believed uh, to an extent, for example, 10 percent. Much more than a certain question. So I can conclude. Puis j'en conclure alors. Can you say whether my conclusion is correct? I can conclude that you only believed. Uh, 90% that the elements would be a, a danger to the party. Vous ne croyez qu'à un certain pourcentage que c'est composé d'un danger Est-ce exact The accused, Réponse. let me reiterate, I Je only répète. believed 10%, Je not 90%, 90% like you said. Pas 90%, comme vous dit. So it means 90%. Donc, they would not be a danger to the party. That's one point. And the second point, Et you had the right and authority to decide on their fate because de the sort. right to smash them Parce halfway was on you. But you chose by not by ignoring them and vous avez dedicate dedicated the responsibility to your coordinate. Is that correct? Yes, exact. The accused, Ms. Réponse. Lawyer, that is correct. Oui, exact. I dedicated the authority to them to decide. Délégué Thank you for your cooperation. I would like now to give the floor to my colleague. Thank you. Dit, uh, la Je donne la parole à mon uh, confrère, si vous le voulez bien, Monsieur le Président. Menki. Maître Kim Menki. Thank you, dear Mr. Merci. President, Your Honours, ladies and gentlemen. Monsieur Let me continue the question for Madame Group Three. Les juges, je poursuis les questions au nom du groupe 3. The questions from my from our victims to the accused. 
question in three cases qui one de nos victimes they want to know les victimes Where souhaitent the savoir were si taken to be les gens étaient emmenés for de pression pour être fruit pour avoir volé un fruit ou pour avoir volé and in the une pomme case, de terre, par exemple. Regarding Et dans le cas de la canal pour trois jours sans nourriture, pour est-il vrai que l'on a fait a single grain un of rice pendant trois jours sans they were forced to work donner quoi que ce soit à manger, constantly à from 2 a.m. until 5 p.m. and in the third case, a lighter was used to burn the elbows and the knees of the female youths who were sick and could not work. Were you aware of these three cases? Avez-vous connaissance de ces cas? The accused, Mr. Lawyer. The pain and suffering of the victims, I would not deny it. I Je ne nie accept, pas la peine et la souffrance I accept des them all. If I did not issue an order, then I would not know. But I would not deny it, Je all the suffering. By the victims. Euh, concernant ces cas. Mais euh, je reconnais la peine et la souffrance des victimes. Thank you. Thank you. Question. My next question. Merci. Voici ma question suivante. It is also the words conveyed by the victims Ceci regarding the method of smashing par, euh, that you said. Concernant les méthodes d'exécution. I did not hear that you ordered the smashing of people by Vous dites, euh, slashing throat ne pas avoir ordonné l'exécution de détenus by beheading the par prisoners. égorgement ou par décapitation. So the by the is Les that victimes posent la question suivante. Did the case occur because the people were taken from prison to Chiang Age Les personnes by beheading the 160 people at Chiang Age Alors est-ce que parmi ces personnes Certaines ont été égorgées ou décapitées. The accused, uh, Mr. Lawyer, Réponse. I heard that info. I heard this as an information, but there is no evidence to show whether it happened de preuve, or not. Uh, qui, uh, nous so de it's hard for me either to accept or deny it. But yes, I have heard that incident. Donc, de dire si When I was the chairman non, of S21, I did Parce not issue any order for beheading any prisoner. That is number one. And number chose. two, I did not hear Mais any information regarding the killing and after that the heads were removed from the bodies. Comme quoi les corps auraient été décapités après l'exécution. thank Question. you for your explanation. Merci de cette explication. I am still unclear je ne comprends toujours that pas très if there bien. is no evidence to confirm de that the beheading took place, que ces décapitations can you confirm lieu, -vous that de the beheading was nous dire a result of si taking the head to show as an evidence instead of uh, providing the report? Avoir la preuve de la mort de la personne the accused? Réponse. I would like to confirm to with you that only important people que ce que pour des who were afraid to be released by the S21, so we were ordered to photograph them. Que nous avions ordre Regarding these 161 people were not amongst those who were ordered to be smashed and photographed. Ce ne sont pas des personnes pour qui nous avons reçu instruction de prendre des photos. This is my clarification for you. Voilà ce que je peux vous dire en guise de précision. Minky, thank you. Question, merci. My next question. You said question was a vous avez part dit que Pressor of S21 in the implementation de of the party's policy line. And your response to the chamber 
was that there were only two remaining classes, the peasant class and the worker class. How come in Preso there were those people who were within the peasant and the worker classes and they were also smashed? Was it the intention of those people working in Preso to do so? The accused, Mr. Lawyer, in theory, two classes were promoted théorie, to be the main classes. However, in the implementation, if you were in the peasant si class and you betrayed the party, then as an parti, individual, alors en tant que you were an enemy. Vous un but for the overall class, yes, the classes were respected. Mais sinon, la classe des paysans, la classe des travailleurs, est effectivement des classes qui étaient respectées. Menke. So you acknowledge that vous reconnaissez donc what happened was in conformation to the party line, à la ligne du parti. the accused, in implementing Réponse. the party line, it's going to be very deep and long. Let me answer euh, briefly. Euh, si je dois vous parler de la the implementation la at the time was biased. We respected Mais the peasants, but not in the actual paysan, implementation. The peasants in the north were easily killed. They only promoted the peasants of Tamok. So that was a bias. Était, uh, bien vu. That's là, why I drew the cartoon dessiné, to show the mis-implementation of the line at the time. Uh, La ligne so, and that was the implementation by the standing committee, Là, and it was uh, wrong. Concrète par le comité permanent. Main key. Question. So, this means the implementation dire, of the CPK political line in Preysor, Preysor or in the north zone, like you just said, la ligne de, du parti était appliquée was a bias implementation si from the nord, actual de, de, de line de, of the CPK policy line. Is this correct? D'une manière uh, qui déviait par rapport à la ligne accused, théorique du parti. Mr. Lawyer, réponse. whoever caused the missed implementation qui, of the line, soit, we need to know who was the source. Elle, and the source was the secretary ligne. of the party. That was Paul la source. Or, la source, So, so we party, could not Pol Pot. protest. Donc, il était we could not object. Pour nous de protester. Il était pas question this is my response. Menke. Question. I have my last question to Merci you. Ma dernière question. You talked about the bias implementation by Pol Pot, the party secretary, parti, uh, and that par it was done Pot, uh, toward Preso. In your Preso, view and understanding, à votre avis, et selon ce the sweat and the blood and the screamed of the victims and the victims' relatives at present time des et des parents des victimes aujourd'hui should there be a level of responsibility for those who implemented the bias political lines ligne can you tell us that partial the accused, Mr. Lawyer. Réponse. If we talk straight to the point, the crimes committed on the Cambodian people after the 17 April 75 until the 6 of January 79 were the CPK's crimes as a whole on the entire Cambodian people. More than one million people were lost. Plus d'un million de personnes y ont perdu la vie. I personally, personnellement, I only blamed one superior. 
je fais porter la faute sur I declared when the trial started une au début du procès that Pol Pot raised Pot the Pot deadline because he had thousands, hundreds of thousands of supporters behind him. That's why he dared to raise the line. So, de the killings of one, or more than one million Cambodian people was the responsibility of all those party members. They had to be responsible before the party, the party and, and the nation and the world. So, not only the party, but all the members had to be responsible for this and had to acknowledge that it was wrong. Il faut reconnaître que ce qui a été fait était mal. And particularly at S21, I am the one who committed the crimes and I am responsible for the crimes. Et qui porte la responsabilité de ces crimes. the superior, they raised a wrong line and Quant au supérieur, on behalf of the party I am responsible for the crimes mauvaise, mais je and I am responsible, responsible for the crimes before this ECCCC tribunal. Devant les chambres extraordinaires. Thank you. Thank you Mr. President. Merci. Group 3 do not have any more questions for the accused. The president. Now I would like to give the floor to lawyers for Civil Party Group 4. Group 4. Mr. Kim Hong, thank you Mr. President. Your Honours, Mr. Hong Kim Son, thank you Mr. President. Ladies and gentlemen, I put a question directly to Mr. Kang Gai Iwe Lies Dut due to time restraint. Yesterday, you spoke about the, the Baku Center, and you told the Chamber and the President that it was a part of 703 Division. Can you say, when you requested the Baku location to be under your management, when was that? The accused. I could only estimate the year. I think it was in 1978 when all the soldiers went to the front battlefield. Thank you, says the lawyer. You also told the president and the chamber yesterday that the Baku location or center was later managed by S24 or Preso. Is that correct? The accused, Mr. Lawyer, that is correct. Thank you, says the lawyer. You also told the chamber that la you went to Presor, que vous êtes allé à Presor or the president said we uh, could call it S24. I am not clear. Can you verify you went to Presor to the Hoi Sreis location? How many times did you go there? The accused, Combien Mr. De fois lawyer. Vous allez à Presor? I went to Preso for four times, and I went to Baku for one time when Kamrat Hui was arrested. Thank you, says the lawyer. Question, merci. As you already told the chamber regarding the categorization of the elements into three groups, one, two, three, and the third group, if we talk about the prisoners, they were the most serious prisoners who were to be smashed. And what about in Baku? How many categories were those people divided into, or were they still called elements? Est-ce qu'on les appelait composants aussi? The accused, Mr. Lawyer. Réponse. Baku was a small location. There was a 
uh, residents of London and a few houses and a uh, one water basin. It was only reserved for the staff of S24 to use as a residence. And as for the elements besides uh, the time that they worked, they slept elsewhere. Thank you, says the lawyer. Question. Uh, at Baku, uh, you said that the elements uh, were also sent to work uh, somewhere surrounding uh, Baku. The accused, yes, uh, they were sent to work uh, there. Yes. Lawyer, thank you. My next question is uh, who sent uh, I want to say uh, the group of elements, uh, most of them were ch women, children, or, or men? Parmi ces the accused. Uh, uh, this is, uh, you are talking about the real practice that I've never réponse, been uh, uh, in that position. I could not answer. Que je Lawyer, connu. thank you. Uh, based Question. on... Merci. Uh, the minutes of uh, interview by the co-investigating uh, church and also the same in the agreed fact in the principle that you said uh, the policy of the CPK and you receive the order and then you further order to your subordinate, your staff or your cadre or your uh, female combatant and male combatant, including in S21 Phnom Penh and at S24 Preso. So what was the limits of uh, authority that you delegate uh, to subordinate so that how uh, many hours, uh, uh, how long that uh, you order your subordinate to uh, force those people to do the work? The accused, in principle, when there was a, a strong attack or offensive, we enforce eight hours working day a day. Uh, but it is uh, 30 days, over 30 days a month. À de 30 the lawyers, jours par mois. Uh, thank you. Uh, Merci. Uh, uh, were you aware of uh, the situation where uh, uh, those subordinates enforce uh, 13 hours a day for uh, those detainees? Uh, en fait the accused, de 13 heures. yes, uh, in the uh, offensive uh, season, it, oui, season it, it was unavoidable that they enforced forcé. that. Lawyer, thank Il you. Le de question, merci. My question is that those you refer to as elements, including uh, category 1, 2, and 3, uh, all of them uh, pro, uh, provided the biography and uh, exposed with the uh, photo on behalf of S21? The accused, uh, I'm not sure. Uh, it is a, uh, uh, the practice uh, at that time. I uh, did not make any instruction uh, like that. Uh, the next question from the lawyer. Uh, did you ever receive a report in form of uh, biography of those elements uh, through uh, Comrade Huisrae or Comrade Ho to you? The accused, uh, your, uh, Mr. Lawyer, I maintain uh, the same uh, position uh, in my capacity and authority. If I need anything, I will get it. But I uh, allow my subordinate to do the job. A question. Uh, you uh, uh, told uh, the chamber about S21 or tool slang and Preso, or S24, it was established uh, since the Division 703 under NAT. It 
means that it is a little bit after the 17 April 1975 and it operated until uh, 6 January 1976 and you also told the chamber that S24 uh, was a re-education center it was not only for the staff from Tools Lang, the staff are from other units. My question is that, uh, what was the different, uh, the difference uh, between uh, the persons or the people who were considered as the prisoner at S21 Tools Lang and those who were in the elements at S24 and that you refer to as the uh, half uh, Prisoner. Ou comme demi uh, for those who transfer to S21, uh, so ah, anyone S24 uh, S21. sent there shall be smashed. So what happened to those detainees at S24? Uh, what was the political uh, policy uh, toward them? Quelle was there any... Um, different decision than uh, you made at Prison, uh, at S21? The accused, uh, anyone who were arrested and sent to S21 uh, Phnom Penh, S21 had to detain at uh, Penyayat High School that we uh, turned it into prison. prison. Uh, secondly, we had to interrogate with torture and Et thirdly, uh, we uh, take, took them out for execution. For Ensuite, those who were detained, uh, who were at Prisor, uh, the question uh, earlier, you said that uh, you call them contemptible or uh, any On m'a déjà demandé si nous les so désignons par uh, uh, des general, uh, 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 beating and torture for interrogation was not allowed. Si and uh, there was no uh, smash without any reason, so they should wait until uh, uh, the times. So those who were in elements unit, they had to work hard to uh, respect the discipline Personne and they had to always order their chiefs so though they have uh, some possibility to survive even though the, uh, the likelihood for this is si more but there's some minima. possibility for them to survive so uh, the possibility difference is only survive. that voilà but difference. for those who were detained in Phnom Penh were all uh, end up with death La mort était garantie. lawyer uh, uh, question. You said that the possibility to survive is uh, just to continue uh, the life or in principle at the end of the day they will be smashed? Cela veut dire vraiment rester en vie ou être, uh, the, accused, en fin the possibility de to survive uh, is to continue onward. Uh, unless he or she committed any offense or a wrongdoing. So if you can uh, follow uh, the order of uh, the chief, you can survive. Mais aux aux chef, uh, lawyer, thank you. Uh, before the break, you uh, question, tell, merci, voilà you told the chamber Vous about the uh, elements and on the fact, uh, the document uh, D-99 on uh, the introductory submission and the agreed facts. It uh, mentioned about the uh, prisoner who suffered the punishment on the immoral often, or the prisoners uh, pretended to be sick or late in coming to work or do not perform uh, that satisfies to the boss. There was uh, experience torture or beating. My question is that at the re-education center at S24, S24 uh, uh, do they have the right to move or to walk around um, at night and uh, during the daytime without any permission? The accused, no. 
giúp kỷ niệm. So at night, Donc, la nuit, uh, could they uh, go out uh, uh, from the, their house or their detention facility uh, outside somewhere? The accused, uh, uh, you, you come to the real practice. I am not in a position to say that, but they can. Uh, they could come out for uh, the facade or to uh, uh, small thing like that. Question: uh, In that uh, regime, I'm talking about uh, uh, S24 or Presor. It's similar to a uh, question made by uh, Sergei Stusinski. Uh, was there any mass uh, marriage uh, for the staff of uh, S24, uh, the president? So um, uh, the question is not fall in the fact, so uh, the accused uh, uh, need not answer. Uh, question. Uh, the management mm. at Preso, because I uh, do not receive any informa information on that, so what, what does the immoral often in the sexual uh, transaction, what does it mean at Preso? Um, the accused, it is the same. For S21 and S24, the immoral often in the sex uh, matter, it's uh, a man and women uh, have sex uh, without any marriage. Uh, this is the definition of the immoral often uh, under that regime. Ou d'une conduite immorale sous le régime. Um, uh, du lawyer, I have another question as uh, permitted Gilles, by the, the president. It is the offense which uh, should uh, the victim should be sent to uh, Jung Ek and to S21. Uh, what was the offense that uh, caused uh, the detainee to be sent to either direction? Uh, un détenu était envoyé soit à S21, soit à Chungek. The accused, I mentioned already, there were two uh, offenses. Is the, uh, the plan to rebel or any uh, tendency to, uh, uh, to oppose act against the guard? This is the uh, serious offense. And the second uh, main offense, and in addition to that, uh, the immoral offense is one of the serious offense. But uh, during the period when I uh, was the chief of S21 and also S24, there was no incident of uh, uh, immoral offense between men and women and there was none of the case that I report to the upper echelon. That's all. Uh, a lawyer, uh, thank you. Uh, I would like to ask your permission, Mr. President, and uh, he said that there was uh, two uh, offenses so uh, what about the transfer of those children directly to Cheung Ek? Uh, the president, uh, please, uh, the accuser, you need not uh, answer this question because it, will, it was already asked. But um, uh, the, they commit no offense, but the, the policy uh, then was that uh, they were fearful of uh, revenge and there were not food supply for them. Uh, so you, your time is running out, uh, Mr. Lawyer. And uh, next, uh, the floor is uh, given to the defense counsel uh, so that you can uh, put uh, the questions uh, to your client uh, on the establishment and uh, operation of the re-education center at Presor or referred to as S24. Uh, lawyer Castlewood. Uh, 
Mr. President and your honors, Monsieur le Président, Madame et Monsieur les juges, um, Mr. Uh, Kang Kek Il, in Kek your uh, response uh, to uh, the question uh, made by Mr. President yesterday, uh, you said hier, that uh, at S24 and S21, the right of movement was limited and it was enforced against the prisoner and you said that it is also enforced against the staff of S24 and S21 and also uh, against you. Uh, was that, uh, is that true? The accused, uh, Mr. Lawyer, it is true, Ceci absolutely exact. true. Absolument. Uh, let me uh, give a short de description the freedom of movement. Uh, we have to travel uh, only Nous on the uh, assignment. So I went to Presor. It is in the framework of assignment. When I went to work with the superior, it is in the framework of assignment. So across the, everyone across the country had to follow uh, that uh, framework. So for the interrogator, uh, they never uh, went to anywhere because uh, they had to follow their uh, assignment in the interrogation. Um, so any travel uh, had to uh, follow uh, the permit, uh, permits. Tout le monde devait a lawyer, uh, yesterday you said uh, that you never visited uh, your mother or your home village. So in practice, uh, can you explain uh, about the right of movement, uh, was there any restriction uh, on that? The accused, uh, Mr. Lawyer, as I uh, told you uh, earlier, uh, uh, travel had to follow the assignment to perform duty. It is important, but uh, the party sometimes allowed, cependant, for example, after my marriage, um, the Anka allowed me to uh, send my wife to Long Wake, and then uh, later after that, I was allowed to uh, accompany my uh, mother to Stone. So uh, the chamber also heard. Uh, that I said that I went chambre, to uh, Brother Hawk. Uh, I did that. Hawk. I had a permission from Je my superior. Uh, in a very few cases, the party uh, uh, accused uh, allow you to do that. Uh, it's, uh, it's not very often. Uh, lawyer, thank you. Uh, the next question. Yesterday, question. you gave an Hier, example about uh, the staff of Nun Hoi who fled. Dévasion, um, state, uh, was it easy to flat uh, during that uh, regime because his staff, uh, the radio operator, uh, can flat uh, successfully and uh, is it easy at that time? The accused, uh, Mr. Lawyer, uh, when you are talking about fleeing, uh, we need to look into two aspects. First, uh, uh, someone move out from the location, from one location to another. It is okay to do so, but uh, uh, when uh, he or she stay in uh, any uh, other location, so there was no uh, destination in the DK that would allow you to do so. Uh, there was uh, there was some people fled from the the unit, but they can uh, do that by hiding in the forest, but they had uh, no food to eat, and then at night they will come out to look for food, and they uh, later arrested. 
So uh, if someone went out from the unit, you can't do that. But uh, the question is that, arrêter. where can you stay? Uh, so uh, uh, they will be considered uh, as the uh, enemy, as the uh, 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 the bad people. So uh, another example that I can give on the 29th of October, uh, I uh, fled from Scone uh, to, to join the, the revolu revolution with the Khmer Rouge. So I can do that because there was a, uh, uh, the people who support that uh, activity. So in conclusion, for those who were uh, in the network, but uh, when you uh, fled away from the network, you will be arrested. So um, I was assigned to work in the Northeast, but uh, my network was cut off at Chess, and later I uh, was sent uh, to another place. Um, so the, the secret Secretary uh, named uh, Sui Paul uh, fled, but um, uh, he uh, hid next to the uh, Chinese hospital. We need to think on this matter. Another case, uh, uh, my superior uh, uh, surveyed me every day. I cannot flee. If, they, if he called, if no one uh, picked up the phone, and uh, they would take, they would take uh, every measure to, to that uh, effect. Von Wett uh, could not escape, and any other could not es escape. That's all I can say. Thank you. Yesterday, in response to too many questions, you said the word re-education means to re-educate and to build oneself as new and become a new person. What does it mean to re-educate and to build oneself as a new person? And as for you yourself, you did not receive any re-education because during that time you were already a new person during the actually one period. Can you describe the method of re-educating oneself to be a new person? The accused, Mr. Lawyer, I had an intention to move myself, to transform myself from an ordinary person to a communist person that was during the 1964 through my training and tempering. And the party recognized me that I would be able to join the party and finally would be a party's member. So I was a new Deutsch who was so different from Kang Gek who was a maths professor. Lui, professeur, In enseignant de mathématiques à school. Thank you, says the lawyer. So when you were a professor, you were an old person in the old regime, and Deutsch, the chairman of S21, you were a new person in the Communist Party of Kampuchea. And Deutsch, at present time, during this current regime, are you responsible for the lives of the 160 children and how? Just to recap, those children were sent directly from S24 to Chiang What is your responsibility? The accused, Mr. Lawyer, I reported already to the chamber Comme je déjà dit devant la chambre. Whatever happened, especially the development passé, of a human being's feeling, it moves steadily. Le développement and my impression on the crimes also move steadily. It started from 1973. À partir de 73, a évolué. 
I said I was shocked for the loss of lives, and there was since 1973, and it progressed from there, and I wanted to leave. And this is not a pretense, or to pretend that I am suffered. Faire semblant que But that souffert. was the progress of Mais my feeling. De, And euh, finally, mes led émotions to, like, cut it short. Et de mes sentiments à ce propos. Et pour répondre à votre question, je suis responsible for the souls lost euh, by comforting my emotions by praying, praying to them. them. Et je prie pour ces âmes. So that was one aspect. And when we met together at the military court, nous, nous from the law legal perspective, le tribunal militaire, d'un point de vue du droit, the blame I could place on the blâme. government. Because I could say I was a policeman at the time, and it was the responsibility of that government at the time. However, now we met again the three of us here before the ECCC. Devant les chambres extraordinaires au sein des tribunaux cambodgiens, we came across the in the questionings during the inter investigation phase, dans le cadre de la phase and now it comes through the trial at the chamber before nous this nous court. Cette chambre. Do you see me as another new person? Que vous pensez que je suis I une bow myself personne. before the Cambodian people, le peuple and that is my attitude. Et telle est mon attitude, l'attitude que j'adopte. Thank you, says the lawyer. Maître. Let me continue my question. Before the, any element was taken to be smashed, was a decision made at your level or was a decision, a decision was made above you? Can you clarify on that? The accused, Mr. Lawyer. L'accusé, maître. I reiterate again to the chamber that the elements who were educated at S24 and based on my own analysis and conclusion, I think it was for all the country. The principal was the party gave the authority to the supervisor at the locations on the issues of re-education Vis -vis des and de the, to stop uh, to prevent any rebellion activity and their fate. So, in general case, de rebellion. as I Donc, reported en règle générale, comme to je dit, Mr. Co. Prosecutor Smith, à Monsieur Smith le I was busy beaucoup de and dedicated the authority Et to my subordinates. And when I said that, it doesn't mean I try to evade from the responsibilities, but because of the workload, I dedicated the work to my subordinate. And to answer your question, I can say, all they made decisions on all matters. Thank you, says the lawyer. Now let me ask you regarding uh, documents, the word release, initially I want to ask, did you see the document D15914.2, and document E47.10, they the same documents as I understand. Il s'agit de même documents. Que, euh, ce que je crois comprendre. Hein. The accused, Mr. Lawyer, these two documents, 
Maître Garçavout. Is the same document with true reference numbers. Actually, they are just one document. En fait, il y a deux cotes, mais un seul document. Garçavout. Can you state that you still maintain your position that the E4710 is a smashed list? Est une liste de personnes exécutées? The accused, Mr. Lawyer, document E4710 is indeed a list of smashed. If so, as Garçavout. Why who wrote to be released? Can you verify on that? Qui a écrit le terme The accused Mr. Lawyer, the word release, through my analysis and conclusion, is just a shadow of the trick that Nat taught Ho, and it was still instilled in his brain. Probably Nat taught him we could use a strategy in writing that we released, but in fact we smashed them. So, that's why he tries to write the word release to me in the case of actual smashing of the combatants and cadres amounting to this 100 number. So it was a feeling instilled in him. Um, and how soldats. come I analyze it that way? The document D57 Annex 003 is an example. This document entitled document, document of Battalion document 96 of the company de la and the document of the company 44 and it entitled for the release. However, the document is with the S21 because the word TSL is another evidence to show that. So when the document is with S21, it proves that NAD indeed used whole to lead Comrade Hunt, the secretary of the Battalion 96, to smash people, but on the document it was written to be released. So that is the first evidence. And Ho himself believed Nat and for the document Nat. E5 slash 2.8, Kamrat Ho wrote it to be released on the 8th of March 76. So the feeling still in still in him, that's why he wrote the word to be released. It was from the belief in Nat that this line was implemented by the party. Thank you, says the lawyer. Can you explain the word to flee or to escape in E47.21.22 and .23? What is the actual definition of that word? Quelle est la définition de ce terme? À quoi correspond ce terme? The accused, Mr. Lawyer. L'accusé, maître. In my entire life, in leading the work at S21, I never heard the word successfully escaped except the one person who was the radio operator. Particularly, the cadres of the company, Sumail, alias Man, in the document, E47.23, serial number 102, I knew this person clearly. He had weaknesses, two critical weaknesses. One, he did not do his work properly. 
He couldn't com- accomplish travail. anything. Il ne pouvait rien faire. And another, per- another big point, he respected not the accepter, most, and he did not listen to anybody Nat else. And to vote me, he did not dare. De moi, il pas. So it's, it's hard to use him as a guard. And he could comme not be used garde. to interrogate. So, Comrade Ho and I decided to have him to the, send him to the rice field. Avons décidé de l'envoyer and finally, à la I sought, enfin, per, I sought permission from the upper echelon to arrest him. And this had a various incidents, but in this document, the document E47.23, Pour ce qui est du document E47.23, at uh, serial number 102, some male alias man, 24 years old, male, S21, chairman of company, agriculture section, director de la compagnie, responsable de la fled on the 24 of October 77, captured on the 27 October. 77. So that was stated in the document. However, from my recollection, it did not happen. And relying on this document, the, the documents showing about the fleeing of the prisoners was probably one of the tricks used or practiced by NAT. They had to fight the serious task imposed by the party. Et il fallait mettre en œuvre so, no one could party. escape, no one Personne could rebel, otherwise you had to be responsible before the party. Sinon, so I had to provide them with these instructions and to encourage them to do their work properly. So in order for them to strive their best to survive, they try to seek other alternative methods, and whether someone could escape or not, the person would be arrested. This is my initial conclusion regarding the word fleeing in the document E47.21.22. And for E47.23, it was an explanation. Et pour le document E47.23, il s'agit là d'une An explication. In the total summary of E47.22, if we read E47.22 on the first column, it talks about the unit. The second was removed. The third, flee, and the fourth column, it was escaped. So if we looked at the fourth column of E47.22, we could see it, see the, the writing there. But on the E47.23, it was, it stopped with this person, male. So there were some mentionings of those who fled, but I do not believe it, because there was no information that I received regarding the escape of these people. How could they escape in mass number like this? The, the mass unit would definitely arrest them, and then the report would be sent to the upper echelon, and then I would be responsible before the, the, the superior. So, if the escape broke out and the base unit arrested them, then they would try to seek the original location where they fled. So I don't believe in it. I believe this is a strategy to use in order to conceal that those people were taken out and smashed. This is my summary on the word escaped. So nobody could escape. And the document E47.21, 22 and 23 would show that I still don't believe that anyone could escape. Let me talk about E47.21. Permettez-moi d'évoquer le document 47 ou de renvoyer au document 47. He wrote Il a écrit TSL P 
PSL 4.513 There was Hui handwriting that one is missing, two is missing, ten, ten are missing, and in details. 10 sont portés disparus ou sont portés manquants. Made on the 23rd of October 78 of October 21 with the Hui signature. So this is clearly a document of S24 under the supervision of Comrade Hui. And it was sent to S21 in Phnom Penh. That's why there was a reference number TSL. And also in this E47.21, it said 32 escaped, 16 to recapture, and the 16 people disappeared forever. If that is the case, then the best units would arrest those 16 people. So, in summary, E47.21 is still showing the strategy that it has to be written that way on the document, document but in fact they were taken out and smashed. So this is just to protect themselves. Let me continue. E47.22 also has the reference TSL. 4.527 and the title was about the, st the statistics of those who lost or missing. The first column it talks about the unit, Première colonne, unit 11, 12, 13, etc. And the second column it talks about the removal, the total was 2,350 people on the third column, colonne, it talks about the date, la date. 2,227 uh, date, and on the fourth column, it's 102 colonne, escaped. 102 so I, this figure was extracted from E47.23 because it talked in details in that document. I acknowledge that these are the documents of S24 which were sent to E21 with a reference TSL on the document and on the third column it Et states that they had and two people who escaped, as I said, based on the document of E47.23. However, I would like to draw your attention about the number of uh, removal is uh, 2,350. If you compare to the, this number to the report uh, by Comrade Hoy in 1977, uh, seven, it's uh, 2,350. Uh, I was surprised about that. I am not denying uh, about my crimes, but I can uh, give you a conclusion and analyze this uh, 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 under my leadership. So uh, it, the number is not true, it's not 2,350. It is the statistic. Uh, since the beginning of the S24 and uh, 227 uh, that it's uh, also uh, from that uh, duration. Et if it is true, uh, the report should uh, be known to me. I think uh, to be clear, uh, there uh, may be connu? more documents uh, y a surviving from Presor. Uh, qui, uh, uh, this is uh, 443 uh, at S24. It, uh, it was not sent to S21. Uh, 
So we need to find out when did it start. Was it from the beginning or the establishment of S21? It uh, will include in uh, the common list of the uh, victims. So if it just uh, started from 1977, we uh, should uh, do a, a further search. So to find out the real number of uh, uh, victims, so we need to, to find the truth, uh, especially uh, my crime against those victims, so we need uh, to work together to find out the truth. I uh, will not contest about uh, my crime, so uh, I can make uh, this explanation based on the existing document. Uh, a lawyer, uh, I would like to uh, ask uh, another question, and it is my my final question, said the lawyer, why uh, did they use uh, this term uh, in a tricky way to say uh, release instead of uh, uh, killing, or sometimes they use uh, the term flee instead of uh, the, the acts committed, uh, the accused. Uh, Mr. Lawyer, it is a trick of not. Uh, as far as I uh, read the documents and my uh, analysis, uh, but uh, during uh, that time I didn't see uh, uh, this document. So the document, it's a lie to say that uh, the detainee were released. Um, uh, D57 uh, Annex 003 and the document uh, which uh, the civil parties E2 slash uh, 56 uh, file a complaint that we can base on these two documents e and uh, put together and report to the uh, upper echelon uh, because not was uh, weak at the time. Uh, the documents uh, uh, recorded the meeting of uh, 1920. Um, uh, April 1976, uh, Nat Sri was reduced uh, from that uh, leadership. Nantes so if uh, that document comes to the uh, upper echelon, Nat will be in trouble. So these are the documents uh, uh, prepared or produced under the trick of Nat. Now we can see uh, the document that uh, to prove the, the tricky uh, uh, activity of Nat. And he said that, uh, please, uh, Anka uh, made it, uh, make it effort to for the list. So uh, the request would be like this. Please, Anka, we need to arrest Anka, this one or that one. It's like that. But uh, in uh, conclusion, uh, I'm not denying my crimes. So I have a tendency to make this conclusion, but I uh, need to put uh, this before the trial chamber and to explain to the Cambodian people on that um, fact. Thank you. The president, the president, now it is time for a uh, break for lunch. And uh, the last question by the uh, defense council uh, were all uh, completed. And uh, as of our schedule, we will have uh, one afternoon for uh, the establishment and uh, functioning of uh, S24, and now we can uh, complete uh, the hearing before uh, the expected uh, the plan of hearing. So uh, the trial chamber declared the adjournment uh, the hearing uh, for today, and we will uh, resume on the 29th uh, from 9 o'clock of Monday. And the party uh, are also advised that uh, the hearing uh, next week, uh, we will hear uh, the testimony of uh, the survivors from S21. So the parties, uh, please be informed and uh, attend and join uh, the hearing as uh, uh, scheduled.
Uh, the security officer take him back to the detention facility and bring him back uh, to the courtroom on the 29th of June uh, before uh, 9 o'clock in the morning.